Hey everyone, so I'm going to start off this video with a bunch of apologies. First, sorry for the messy background. Second, sorry for having two hauls in a row, but I really, really needed to post a video and this is one that I just went shopping and I was like, okay, I'll home haul because a lot of you guys would have wanted to see it anyways. Um, and hauls are kind of like my favorite videos to film because I like sharing what I get with you guys and you guys kind of giving me feedback on what you think of the products or a product that you would recommend me to try. So, basically, I went shopping yesterday and I got a lot of stuff that I needed and I got a lot of stuff that was I was just like, you know what, why not, like, let me get that. Um, some of the th things that you see in here are for homecoming because homecoming week is this week. First, Burlington. Uh, so, one of the days that I'm uh, going to homecoming, I had to have white gloves. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet because people at my school see this video. I don't want them to be the same thing as me. So for one of the days, I needed gloves, and these look really, really small, but they fit my hands because I tried them on in the store, and they're really, really cute because they have like bows on them, and I thought, okay, with this outfit, this is going to look really cute, and it actually came with a little like wedding veil, like for like a flower girl or something, but I don't really know what I'm going to do with that, so. And then I got like five dresses, I think, because my mom was like, ooh, this dress is cute, this dress is cute, and then I tried them all on, and we liked the majority of them. I think I'll only put three of the eight back, so, yeah. This is the first one. It's a maxi dress, and I don't have any maxi dresses, so I really, really like it, and it's kind of like uh, white right here, obviously, and then it goes really, really long, and it's like this kind of tribally print pattern, but it's really, really cute, and, um... Yeah, I'm not going to wear this one for homecoming, and oh, by the way, our homecoming days, like, the Friday is, um, Sunday's best, where you wear, like, uh, clothes that you would wear to church or whatnot, um, just like your nicest clothes that you have in your closet, but the next dress I got is this cute, 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 kind of like skater sh skirt dress, yeah, and it's just black and white, kind of tribally print again, but, um, like I said, it cinches here at the waist. And then I got this really, really cute dress, and um, I don't know which, I think I know which one I want to wear, though. I don't know if I want to wear this one or not, but it looks like this, and this is the top, and then the bottom kind of goes into, like, a pencil skirt type thing, and I don't know, it's really cute. It has this, like, necklace or whatever you want to call it, embellishment or whatever, I don't know what this is, already on it, and yeah, it's cute, so. And then next, I got one that's similar to that but then again it's different so uh it's got another like little necklace looking thing on it but this one is more this one isn't spaghetti strap it's more of a wide strap as you can tell and um it's kind of it's still flowy at the top and then the bottom is a pencil skirt again but yeah i like the black one better than this one just because i think i kind of like when my shoulders show i guess more and then the last one that i got which is probably the one that i'll be wearing is so cute and so like little black dress or whatever and I'll be able to wear this a lot because just because it is a black dress and um, basically it kind of like crosses over here in the front and then it gets um, I don't remember if it got tighter at the bottom or if it got looser but I think it was tighter I'm not I'm not sure and then next I'll show you I guess or 21 because I didn't get too much stuff there I just got literally things that two things that I needed and um, one little like weird thing and then one thing that I needed for homecoming. So, the first little weird thing is this little head massager. My mom has one of these, but she doesn't know where it is, and she was doing it to me in the store, and I was like, ah, and it was only $1.90, so I was like, can I get one? She's like, sure. I don't know, but yeah. It's just pink, and it's like the little thing that you do like this on your head, and it feels so good. And then I got a white and a black tank top, just a regular kind of like it's a v-neck yeah I don't even know that but yeah it's a regular v-neck tank top and then the white one is the same way and last thing I got from Forever 21 was something that I've been needing or not really been needing but something that I needed for homecoming week and it's just a plain white v-neck shirt and then I went to Party City which I think I forgot to mention at the very beginning but I had to get some stuff for homecoming from here and first I got face paint because obviously I need this for one of the days and then I got white face paint because this is like more and I, what did I 
I need white for? Oh, 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 just kidding, just kidding. I know what I need white for. Okay, and then I got a little black makeup stick for like around your eyes. And then I got suspenders because we're having a nerd day. And then, oh, this is from Burlington, but it was just a bag inside of the other bag. And my mom got this little uh, lotion from OPI, but that's not mine, so. And then I went to icing and got um, two things that I needed for my, um, for nerd day, which I can tell you guys that day because that's like a day that everybody wears nerd stuff. So I got these cute glasses, but I might like, I got ones that I would wear like on like a day to day basis. Like, so I might wear them in videos, but not today because look how glary they are and they need to be cleaned off, but cause they're like foggy as crap. Um, but yeah, these were $14 and then I got some thigh high tights, which you're probably like, Gracie, how are you going to wear those to school? But, um, and I don't know if I'm going to wear the bows on them because I might look like a stripper. But I'm being like a cute nerd, not like a sexy nerd, you know what I mean? But like a cute nerd that wears like kind of cute stuff, but a girl with glasses, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, yeah, because I don't want to be like an ugly, like tacky nerd. But, yeah. Then I went to TJ Maxx Columbia fleece jacket because I've been really wanting a fleece jacket. And I know it's not winter time yet, but um, it was a lot cheaper than it normally is. So, um, it was originally $36, but I got it on sale for like $21, I think. I got two little things for my phone. So, I got this cord from Candy Wires, and it's a flat lightning sync and charge cable. And, yeah, it's this bright neon color because I love neon colors, obviously. And then I got this little voltage portable power for mobile devices. So, you press it. No. You press it to turn it on and hold it to turn it off. And it's by the brand Urban Beats. With a Z. It's kind of heavy. So, basically, Victoria's Secret looks like this. Every Victoria's Secret bag does, I'm pretty sure. Unless you get, like, a bigger one. I don't really know. But, yeah. Um, so, the first thing I got is this little perfume and it's the Victoria's Secret bombshell and I have this full size of it over here. It's actually my sister so I'm thinking one day she's gonna take it from me but um so I got a backup just in case she takes it from me one day and hers she lost her lid but this is my lid um and yeah this was $15 and this one was $25 so it was obviously a better deal to get the bigger one but I could not find the bigger one while I was there so yeah but Okay, then the next thing I got is for homecoming week. We have to be a celebrity, and I'm going to show you the shirt, and you're going to be like, wow, I know who you're being. So I got this shirt, and it says on Wednesdays we wear pink. And then I got a bra because I got this little, like, $10 off any bra thing. Oh, my gosh, it was crazy while I was there. So basically I picked everything out that I wanted, and then I went to the cash register, and I got this uh, $10 off a bra, a free thong, which I don't really wear thongs, but I just got one anyways. I was like, hey, okay. Um, but I don't wear them usually, so it'll probably just sit in my drawer. But, um, you could get that, a free thong, and then $10 off, I don't know. No, I don't know. And you could get, like, this free, uh, rose panty or whatever, and those are, like, the, my favorite ones anyways. So I was like, Thank you, Jesus. You are awesome. Like, yesterday was probably one of the best days of my life because I kept it getting good stuff. And then, if you spent a certain amount of money, you got to do these little scratch-off things. And my mom got a free panty, so I went and got another pair of underwear. And then I got a free bra, so I gave my mom the free bra thing. And I got $10 off this bra, which I have the same bra, but in tan. And it looks like this. And it's the t-shirt bra. Perfect something. Perfect toucher. I don't really know. But yeah, I love it, and so now I have a tan one and a black one, and um, it has a little bit of push-up in it, but not like a big hump like these do. Hold on, I'll show you. These are the ones that I normally, or these are the ones that I first got from Victoria's Secret, and I'm wearing my hot pink one of this right now, but um, it's just, it has like a major push-up in it, but it's um, still like really soft, but this one you could, like I actually feel like I'm wearing a bra, but this one, like, I know that I'm wearing a bra because I obviously put it on, but like it's not uncomfortable. 
And then I got a ton of underwear. So I got five for like the $26.50 or whatever it is. And then um, I got a few pairs for free. So this is a... I know you guys probably don't want to see my underwear, but I'm going to show you anyways because they're super duper cute. The cotton hip huggers and they have like the cute lace at the top. So these are this purple color with chevron at the top, or I think they're chevron. They look like kind of chevron. I don't know. And then I got these that say pink. And then these are different, a little bit different though because these have the lace right here, but there's not really any difference in feel. And then I got... These cute ones that have like flowers at the top, and then these also have flowers at the top, but they're like bright, like, what I mean by flowers, like, you know, like that's like in the shape of a flower, if you can tell, I don't really know. And yeah, these are really cute. And then I got another one pair that says pink at the top, but different colors. And then I got this pair, really cute. And then I got this pair, really cute. And then I got this pair, which is also really, really cute. But. Yeah, I ended up getting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pairs of underwear, and three of them were for free. But last but not least is Sephora. I got the bronzer, the Milk Chocolate Soleil Light Medium Matte Bronzer, which was $30. And so this is the Kat Von D Lock It Tattoo Concealer. And it's awesome. I tried it in the store, and yeah. I got the Better Than Sex Mascara, which was 23 And by the way, this is literally my fourth one of these to buy because it's amazing and um, they're awesome. So this one will probably last longer because Bailey will have her own and will be using mine. And then I got the Anastasia Brow Wiz. This is my second time to repurchase. No, this is my second one of these to have and it kind of lasted me a long time. My first one did. And I was like, you know what, I gotta get another one of those. It was amazing. And I love pencils more rather than like eyeshadow or like shadows to use or powders or gels. Um, this is just so much easier to use. That is all that I got in my haul. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And um, if you have tried out these products before, like you really enjoyed, like just that you really enjoy in your everyday makeup routine or that you um, have tried it and you didn't really like it, just let me know in the comments because I like to see like different things that work on different people. So yeah, um, I love you guys so much.